Hey guys, welcome to Cute Tea Drawings. Today I'll be drawing the cardboard cutout version of Miss Delight from Poppy Playtime. I'll be drawing on my tablet, but you can also follow along on paper, and please remember to like and subscribe. Okay, now let's get started. Okay, let's first start off at the top and let's draw the mouth. Let's start with the curve across. Then at both ends, let's draw a small curve. And then a longer curve underneath like this. And then lastly, inside, let's draw a curve on both sides across the center. Next, I'm going to zoom in and draw the rest of the face. Let's draw a curve on top for the nose. And then two curves underneath for the nostrils. Next, let's add the eyes. Let's draw a curve on top on the left and on the right. And then a curve on top of each one. Next, inside each eye, let's draw another curve at the bottom. And then color both of these in black. Now let's move to the outside and let's draw three curves for the eyelashes. And then lastly, a curve on top of each eye for the eyebrows. And that's it for the face. Now let's move up and let's start drawing the hair. Let's start on the top right and let's draw a wavy line down next to the eye. And let's do the same thing, but we're going to bring it all the way over to the left side. Now underneath both sides, let's draw a curve down. And then a wavy line underneath and out. Now top in between and let's draw a curve across for the bottom of the face. And then inside, let's draw a curve on both of the cheeks. Now let's hop back up to the top and let's finish drawing the hair. From the top right, let's draw a curve up and bring it over to the left, stopping here. Next, let's add the bow. Let's leave a gap and let's draw a square. Then from the top, let's curve it up, wave it down, and back in. And the same on the other side. And then inside both sides, let's draw a small curve from the middle. Now let's hop down under the bow and let's draw another curve going down. Now let's move back over to the right side. From the top, let's draw a wavy line down like this. Now from the ends, let's curve it out and back in on both sides to close off the hair. Next, inside of the bottom, let's draw a curve going in and then up. And the same on the right side. And then one more curve near the bottom. Now inside that bottom section, let's draw some diagonal lines. And also a few diagonal lines inside the small curve. And that's it for the head. Now let's move in and let's draw the body. Underneath the head, let's draw two small lines down for the neck. And then a V-shape underneath. 
Now from the sides, let's draw another angle down. Then bring it down and up on both sides for the collar. Now next to the collar, let's draw lines out to the hair. And then continue it down with a curve on the other side. Now let's move back to the middle and let's draw a curve for the top of her dress. And then add two curves down on the top left and on the top right for the straps. Now inside the top section, let's add the tie. Underneath the collar, let's draw a small V-shape and then two angles down. Now let's move back down and let's draw a curve for the sides of the body and a curve across the bottom. Now let's hop inside and let's draw the apple. Let's draw a C-shaped curve and then another one out to the right. Now on top, let's draw a small skinny triangle for the stem and then the leaf on the top right. And that's it for the apple design. Now let's move down and let's draw the belt. Let's draw a curve down on both sides and then a curve at the bottom. Next, let's hop inside and let's draw two curves on the right. And then underneath, we're gonna draw two long teardrop shapes. And then add a curve inside each one at the top. Next, let's move to the sides and let's draw a long curve down for the sides of the skirt. and then close off the bottom with a wavy line across. And that's it for the main part of the dress. Now let's move to the sides and add the sleeves. Next to the upper body, let's draw another small curve going out on both sides. And then a curve across. Now underneath, let's draw two curves down. And then a wavy line across. Next underneath, let's add the arms. Let's draw two curves going down. And then another curve on the bottom for the hands. And that's it for the body. Now let's add some shading lines. Let's start inside the top of the arms and let's draw a curve across. And then add some diagonal lines inside. Now in the upper part of the sleeves, let's draw a curve. And again, diagonal lines. Lastly, let's add some diagonal lines next to the neck for the back of the hair. And that's it for the shading. Now let's move down and let's draw the feet. Underneath the dress in the center, let's draw two lines down. Then let's move out and let's draw a curve down and out. Then let's add a square on both sides for the middle of the bows. Now on each side of the square, let's draw two bumps like this. Now to close off the shoe, let's draw a curve down and bring it back around.
and then lastly another curve inside. And that's it for Misty Light, now let's quickly color her in. And done. Hope you enjoyed drawing along with me and please remember to hit that like button and subscribe for more videos. Thanks for watching.